Og så hjem igen til fredelige lille Danmark, hvor dagen i dag jo er dagen, hvor Spice Girls er i landet. For godt en time siden begyndte den første af to koncerter i København. Så kom de endelig, Spice Girls, som de forventningsfulde fans har ventet på i månedsvis. De fleste er piger, og mange af dem er endnu ikke teenagers. Jeg håber på, at de snart kommer i hvert fald, for ellers ved jeg ikke, hvad jeg skal gøre, fordi jeg vil gerne se dem. How are you in Copenhagen? Good. Good. It's beautiful outside. It's very yeah. sunny. Sure, it's funny because, you know, we wake up in, in a lot of different countries, and I woke up this morning and it was really sunny, Love really that. nice view, lots of fans outside the hotel to welcome us, and got a really, really good feeling about this place. Really yeah. excited really about it. I want to say thank you to all our Copenhagen yeah. fans, and we're sorry that it's taken so long for us to get here, but we're here, finally. Spice Girls har faktisk kun udgivet to CD'er, men det er været nok til, at de er blevet et af de mest succesfulde bands i popverdenens historie. Samtidig er det lykkedes dem at skabe en milliardforretning. Salg af alverdens ting og sager indgår lige så naturligt som musikken. Alene i Danmark er der solgt omkring 200.000 dukker af Spice Girls. For hvor mange penge Spice Ting har du? Mange penge, men jeg aner ikke hvor mange. Nok over 1000, tror jeg. The thing is with um, merchandise, it's been very difficult for us because there's been a lot of um, bootleg stuff which is unofficial. And um, obviously, we want to give our fans stuff that is official and is good quality. So we have, ha we, you know, we like to bring out um, official stuff which is good quality, and hopefully they won't buy the other stuff. That's why it looks like there's so much. Every group is marketed in a in a way. That's the way you express yourself, and that's what we've done. I think, you know, it's worked for us. And By the way, can we talk about that. the music? Because that's what's important. That's what we're here for today. To do our live show for all our fans. That's more important, isn't it? Positivt siges det om bandet, at det er godt med det såkaldte girl power fenomen, hvor pige fans ser op til kvinder med succes. Kritikere mener gruppen er for beregnende og døgnfluer i musikens kommersielle univers. Men lige meget hvad, Spice Girls er i gang med deres tredje CD. Well, I think the third album is going to be slightly different because there's going to be individual stuff on there. There's going to be other writing collaboration because we write our own stuff. There's going to be like duets on there, so it's going to be different for us and make it keep it alive for us. And it's going to be something new and different for our fans as well. Og Spice, Spice Girls hedder, at de giver deres anden koncert i morgen, aften, samme tid og samme sted.